we mentioned before that Colts that Colts Jaguar game with Andrew Luck with Marlon Mack, and now we get to Leonard Fournette, who is finally expected to return this week for Jacksonville. It's been a long time coming. Are you comfortable, Jim, to put him in your lineup? Normally, no. I, I don't like using players coming off of long, extended injuries because there's always concerns they'll get eased back in, eased back in and that does worry me for sure, especially because the Jaguars just got Carlos Hyde, and maybe they will keep Leonard Ford out of the box. But there are a couple of reasons those concerns for me are not enough to keep Leonard Fournette out of my rosters. The first one is the price. The price does account for those risks because FanDuel has Leonard Fournette priced at $7,000 for this week. That is not a super high price tag, and I will pay that for a guy who is this good. The second thing that I like about Fournette is that he practiced in full on Wednesday. That means he is going to have three full practices by the time he gets back out there on the field. And to me, that says he is fully healthy, and I'm willing to use it. When healthy this year, again, it's been only 45 snaps. That's not an exaggeration. It's been literally 45 snaps this year. But when he's been healthy, they have used Fournette a lot. And that includes on third down, which to me says, even if the Colts do get ahead in this game, Leonard Fournette is probably still going to be out there and probably catching some passes. He had three targets in that Giants game in the opener before he left that game early. The Colts defense, they're healthier now than they were before, so that's certainly a plus, but they are ranked 19th against the rush. I think that Fournette can get some work against them on the ground. I think he can get some work in the passing game, too. For So for $7,000, I think this is a situation where you just kind of assume that Fournette is healthy because the tea leaves say he is based on the full practice on Wednesday and they're probably going to lean pretty heavily on him given the way this team wants to play football. So I think you want to buy back in on Fournette before the public does. This is not a bad spot to do so. So for me, $7,000 is a really solid place price tag to alleviate the fears I do still have around Leonard Fournette. It's all about the price when it comes to Leonard Fournette. And if you can swallow the fact that Leonard Fournette may not get all those carries, it is his first game back, Price is worth it. I'd rather do it in a tournament than a cash game, but Leonard Fournette certainly out there for the taking this week for Jacksonville.